This is the August 30th, 2013 edition of Inside Rensselaer, about the people, the programs, and events at Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute. The incoming class of 2017 promises to be an exceptional group with an increase in average SAT scores and 145 receiving a perfect 800 SAT critical reading, math, or writing score. 72% of the students are from the top 10% of their high school classes. Tissue engineering and stem cell expert Leo Q. Wan has been named a Pew Scholar in the Biomedical Sciences by the Pew Charitable Trusts. And he recently won a prestigious Faculty Early Career Development Award from the National Science Foundation. Over the summer, area students sharpened their math and science skills during the ExxonMobil Bernard Harris Summer Science Camp. The two-week all-expenses-paid program, founded by astronaut Bernard Harris, Jr., is one of 20 camps that were held on university campuses nationwide. Colonies of bacteria grown aboard space shuttle Atlantis behaved in ways never before observed on Earth, according to a new NASA-funded study. The space-grown biofilms formed a column and canopy structure not previously observed and had a greater number of live cells, more biomass, and were thicker than control biofilms grown under normal gravity conditions. Rensselaer IBM and the Fund for Lake George in June announced the launch of the Jefferson Project at Lake George, a three-year multi-million dollar collaboration with the goal of understanding and managing complex factors, including road salt, stormwater runoff, and invasive species threatening one of the world's most pristine natural ecosystems. The Jefferson Project aims to establish one of the Earth's most sophisticated lake environmental monitoring and prediction systems. The U.S. Navy is turning to the Information Technology and Web Science Program at Rensselaer to prepare a select group of U.S. Navy officers with skills needed for military cyberspace operations. Rensselaer has launched a new university-wide initiative to tackle the challenges and opportunities of big data, the Rensselaer Institute for Data Exploration and Applications. Catherine Royer, an expert in molecular biophysics, has joined Rensselaer as a Constellation Chair in Biocomputation and Bioinformatics and Professor in the Department of Biology. And Richard Gross, an expert on biocatalytic and chemical synthetic methods, has joined Rensselaer as a Chair in the Biocatalysis and Metabolic Engineering Constellation and Professor in the Department of Chemistry and Chemical Biology. Earlier this month, IBM announced that Rensselaer is among nine new academic collaborations focusing on big data and analytics, designed to prepare students for the 4.4 million jobs that will be created worldwide to support big data by 2015. And last month, 24 middle school girls from the Schenectady City School District took part in a summer camp on campus designed to spur an interest in science, technology, engineering, and math and initiate mentoring relationships with women in STEM careers. The week-long learning program called GE Girls at Rensselaer is sponsored by the GE Women's Network in collaboration with Rensselaer. That's it for this edition. For more on these stories and others, go to www.rpi.edu slash about slash inside.